Hello, Augies Worldwide. I'm Dave Kastler, amateur radio call sign KE0OG, and I want to bring your attention to something that's part of our worldwide Augie group. Okay, this is a small book uh, written by um, Maurizio Marti in Italy, and his call sign is um, Italy Victor 3 X ray Alpha Zulu. Now, what a lot of Americans don't realize when they think of uh, so-called magnetic loop antennas, which some people want to call small loop antennas, they're made so differently from large loop antennas, it's convenient to have a different term for them. But in Europe, they're extremely popular. One of the reasons they're so popular is because they take up so little space and that space is at a premium. And also, in, you might consider Europe to be one giant homeowners association. They put a lot of restrictions on what you can do with your land. I mean, in Switzerland, they go so far as if you are thinking of building a house, you have to get a bunch of bamboo and construct a full-size outline of the house on the property so that other residents can see where it will sit and whether it will block their views and they all have the power to say no. So Europe's a very different environment from the United States which is why uh, they do a lot of loops. Now since they do a lot of loops like good hams everywhere they experiment with them. Have you ever thought of a mag loop having more than one turn? two, three turns to extend the frequency range. Have you ever thought of building your own capacitor for one of these? Well, this book goes into that. So I want to show, what I want to show is this book. It's available on uh, Amazon and it's called IV3XAZ and you can just search on his call sign. Okay, plays the loop. And he has pictures of loops that he's built. Notice this one that has three turns. And notice the size of that loop that feeds it, uh, the one that's up in there. It can go down to 80 meters and even 160 meters. And so that's what these people are doing. Now, what he has in this book is picture after picture after picture of how to make uh, these loops. There are just all kinds of them here. Different kinds of loops that he's built, both receiving and transmitting. Okay, and uh, about preamps. Here's a multiple turn loop. He talks about a material that's available in Europe that I've never seen here in the US, which is PVC pipe that's layered. It has aluminum layers inside. So you can actually bend that and use it uh, as a conductor because of the aluminum inside. And he's got some formulas in here, some examples, talks about how to build your own capacitors, uh, and it's just got a lot of neat things that are going on. And he has uh, examples of how well this has worked for him. He has even worked across Europe from his location right here in Italy. Uh, and it's got spreadsheets in here and so on. This is available on Amazon and I would suggest, uh, and I don't get a kickback for this, uh, just go ahead and look up that call sign and uh, you can find that it's ten dollars for the download of the uh, book on Kindle and it's like $15 for a paperback. Again, it's not very thick. So uh, he sent me a PDF of it because that was the only way he could get it to me. So there you have it. Now, um, I will put in the description for this video a direct link to the book that will be one of my links. You'll get to it for the same price, but I get a little bit of support for the channel. Uh, for doing it. But thank you very much 
Maurizio. This is a very interesting book that can really introduce American hams to the European designs in loop antennas which help cover lower and lower bands with more and more efficiency by using multiple turns on the thing. So there you have it. So, um, Maurizio, thank you very much for sending that this way. If you have watched this far in this video, I would ask you please to subscribe. That's the thing that helps me out the most. Uh, also click like and uh, tell other people, share the video. And there's an easy way you can click share. There's an easy way on YouTube to click share and you can pick up a little link there that you can email to other people. So also please go to decastler.com support and look for a way that works for you. And until we next meet, 73.